What is going on guys, Bangalini here coming back at you with another video today back on ML No whoa 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 Madden 18 Connected franchise with the 49ers today facing the Dallas Cowboys at AT&T week 17 We are currently tied For the NFC West lead, but the Seahawks are technically ahead, I guess um, Which I don't do have we beaten them twice Hold on so we lost to them the first game by two, and then we beat them. I guess they would somehow hold the tiebreaker at this point. I'm not sure. Let me see the uh, the full standings for the NFC and see exactly. We haven't clinched yet for sure, uh, but neither have the Seahawks. Only two teams have clinched, the Cowboys and the Falcons. So the Cowboys are essentially playing for nothing in this game, and we are playing for a playoff spot. The most important game of the season, you could say. Because if we lose, I don't think we're making the playoffs at 9-7. and seven. Let's get after it. It's a draw. Close down. That's a great tackle by Solomon Thomas. The Cowboys have been moving uh, down the field a little bit. Prescott rolling out. We're going to close down on him. Diving Des Bryant, I think that was. Couldn't make the catch. We are in Season 4 of this of course des bryant was cut in real life as dan bailey's gonna come out here and attempt a long field goal this is from the 40 this is gonna be like what a 50 53 yard field goal at least longer than that hold on he is short was that, that might have been what 63 i don't know where he was taking that from was that from midfield i didn't really see so dan bailey took it from wow it looks about the 48 so you, you can tack on 10. That was a 58-yard field goal. I couldn't tell where it was on the field. Uh, May 57-yard field goal. Would it show? 57 yards, maybe, for the Cowboys? Kicking Dan Bailey. Missed. I'm curious, actually. I know, of course, it's going to be 50-plus. Maybe in the game log? Is that a thing? 57 yards. There we go. All right. We got there. It didn't really even matter, but I was curious. Oh, here we go. That's good blocking as well. Walter Wiley. Decent gain to start things off here. Dante Buchanan breaks a tackle. He's off to a hot start. I mean, he's our best receiver. I mean, we do have Devontae Parker. We have Sanchez Heaney. But you guys see it time and time again. And do we throw him the ball a lot? Yeah. I, but he's the biggest playmaker. I don't even know if it's debatable. We're going to throw to him. Inside pass lead. Dante Buchanan. Touchdown. Let's go. He's just, he's always open. Unless he's double teamed. And we got him good inside throw. Beat everybody on the, uh, what, cover two maybe? Oh, wow. That's open. He catch that? I guess so. That's a user pick. Easy reads. Green eggs and ham. Derek Winfield. Dak Prescott is just very fast. I thought we would have had something there. Fifth interception for Derek Winfield on the season. He's pretty quietly had an amazing season so far. We're going to step up. Oh my goodness. Couldn't get the speed. Malik Collins with the sack. Oh, OJ Howard wide open over the middle. First down. On third and 21 after a sack. We're going to find OJ Howard and Joey Lockler has no incompletions on the day so far. There's still time for it. I mean, we're not playing for, you know, a perfect uh, record out here. That's going to be intercepted. Ronald Darby. Thought we could sneak it by him and he might have a touchdown here. Joey Lockler is fast. Is he fast enough? He is. Wraps up, saves a touchdown. Tough play though. He's going to throw over the middle. Wow. That's that's a perfect play call and perfect execution by Dak Prescott and what might be Terrence Williams. He's wearing number 83. Honestly, I don't know. He didn't look much like Terrence Williams, but did he get that left foot down? It's Thompson. Deontay Thompson? Are they going to call this a touchdown? He was wide open. It is a touchdown. We'll, we'll be seven all. We're going to call for a QB draw here. We very seldom go to this. But it should be open. Oh my goodness. Tried to lower the shoulder with Joey Lockler there. 
I mean, if that safety wasn't on a uh, hook zone in the middle, that's an easy first down. But it will be third and nine. We'll try to somehow pick it up. It's not that far. There's Devontae Parker, actually. And he's going to catch it and throw somebody off. That's a first down. That was TJ McDonald who couldn't wrap up. And this is a perfect play for Walter Wiley. Just such speed to the outside. If he can get around here, which he can't. Broke a tackle anyway. Just We needed that block to hold a, you know, maybe a second or two longer on the outside. And he is gone, maybe. Maybe. See Devontae Parker in a one-on-one. -on -one. We're actually just going to ch check down. This offensive line just doesn't play well. I think part of it has to do with how tough the sliders are. But we have so few seconds to throw sometimes when pressure comes in. And I mean, when, look, at, look at what's happening. Dante Fowler Jr. I mean, what can, what can we do there? Honestly, really, what can we do? Oh, that was so close to being blocked. It's going to be a good punt, though. Deontay Thompson, I believe, is going to call for a fair catch. Joey Cummings might have some space on this return if we have a decent block. Just absolutely none. No one wanted to block anybody, per usual. Please... There we go. Dante Buchanan drops the ball on second and 10. We're going to throw this up. Dante Buchanan. That's, oh my God, he made the catch. What a poor throw. I mean, you clearly have the pass lead there. Down the sideline. I mean, he was open. There was an incredible amount of space. But in Madden 18, uh, every single ball ever is underthrown. To the point of where it's always a contested ball instead of a, uh, you know, a good pass when you lob it up. You know, even you think, you know, lob it to the area. You have such amazing short, medium, and deep accuracy. Now they're all above 90, yet it's just a bad throw. Dante Buchanan makes an incredible catch. There we go. There we go. Devontae Parker drops the ball. Great coverage from Ronald Darby. It's going to be third and 12. We got a score here. I would love a touchdown. I tried this for Walter Wiley earlier. Here's Joey Cummings. He's proven to be a tri uh, big playmaker on certain trick plays. We're going to spin. That's a quick spin. We're going to go for the hurdle. He doesn't get any fumbles. No. It's recovered by Byron Jones. We didn't score. That was such a dumb decision to go for the hurdle, but it would have been sick. It would have been. It would have been so cool if we got it. Tough. And that is going to be the half. I don't even think they're going to run this play, but they might. They're actually going to call it. And Ezekiel Elliott has nowhere to go. I get four yards. Are we serious? How? Running lanes, for the most part, haven't been there. Tried to get through that one, just not quick enough, I guess. Here we go. We're going to step up. We're going to try to make the throw to A, man. I couldn't get it off. We had a receiver open over the middle, yet we're going to get sacked. And it is a, another time being sacked. Four in just over two quarters of action. Throw the ball. Throw the ball. You're getting picked off. Oh, my goodness. Dak Prescott outrunning DeForest Buckner and gets a huge gain of 15. Okay. Oh, wow. All right. Didn't uh, that yeah, it didn't go well. 14 7 Cowboys probably. Let's check down. OJ Howard takes a gigantic hit there on third and ten. We cannot convert again. Oh, huge hit. Who's even number 26? Keanu Neal, I think that is. Gonna force third and eleven. This defense has got to step up today against the Cowboys. If they manage to get a first down here. Turn that into a score. We are in trouble. That's a screen. Someone get over there. Willis Burdine going to wrap up. Makes the tackle. Former first round pick. I think he was the first first round pick in this 49ers franchise. And a little bit lackluster for us so far. Although we don't see many cornerback interceptions. It's just not something that happens with these sliders, unfortunately. Um... But, I mean, if we did get a bunch of picks, everyone would keep complaining about how easy the games are just because I win. So, I mean, like, 
I don't know. People complaining gets annoying. Tell you that much. Joey Cummings just a bit short. Kind of got warped into my offensive line there. Uh, and we're not going to punt on fourth and one from about midfield. Not going to happen. Do we fake? We're actually just going to take a timeout. All right, the play call is going to be a play action halfback swing, I believe. Although that right side of the field looks pretty open. We're going to change this to a motion inside zone for Marcus Wiley here on fourth and one. And he gets it and more. Marcus Wiley. 16 yards on fourth and one. Oh, Buchanan got a great, great jump off the press. The ball, again, badly underthrown. It's not even the quarterback. It's not Joey Lockler. And I've said this so many times. It is literally the game. They've coded deep throws so badly. And you saw Dante Buchanan had all the space in the world trying to lob it up and just say, hey, go run underneath the football. And nope, ball terribly underthrown. And he could have easily dropped that. I made a really nice play, and of course, again, I get warped because the game wants me to follow the run path when I go straight up the middle. Uh, and I know I complain a lot. I just talked about complaining, but like, these are legitimate concerns. The game's got to play better if it's going to be better. I don't think there's any secret that this is Madden's, like, you know, in the community, one of the least well-received games um, for Madden. And there are just so many issues, and that, a lot of that's Ultimate Team. The gameplay is not good overall that's open no time to throw the ball <sighs> we're gonna we're gonna go for it here we go big block from use check walter wiley too fast touchdown tie ball game essentially we'll convert the extra point big big touchdown that's why you bring in the speed goal line toss 14 to 14. Up the middle. Get after the QB. That's wide open. Pittman with a huge gain. Where are my defensive backs? Oh, no. Oh, no. All right. Way to wrap up. Can't allow a touchdown here. Field goal is fine. Doesn't really hurt us that bad. Preferably would like to allow nothing. Oh, it is a run. Foster on second and seven. He is dragging my defensive line with him. This is a huge third and four. Could decide the game. Oh, big play to kind of tap that one away. I think it was Perry Cox forcing the field goal. That was huge. I'm going to roll out here with Lockler. He's got a little bit of space. We're certainly going to slide and not take a hit. This game is very winnable. I mean, we played the Seahawks last week. We had a similar record. I mean, the Cowboys record is better uh, considerably, but we have the same exact record as the Seahawks, and we were pretty much dominant. The running game hasn't been able to get going. The passing game, not so much either. The offense from the Cowboys has been way better. This has really been a tough team. Big third and six. We're going to run. Slide, first down. All right, keeps the drive alive. Oh, what a spin move from Walter Wiley. There's Walter again. Good open field spin move, and what a tackle. That saved a touchdown. Saunders there. And honestly, not the worst thing. We've been playing the clock in this quarter when we've had the ball. A minute and 22 to go, as I say that. We want to chew up this clock. We don't want to give the Cowboys an opportunity to score. We're going to roll out and throw it away. Roll out again. We got an option there. Throw the ball. Get it in, Devontae Parker. First down inside the five. All right, huge play here for Wiley. Let's punch it in. Marcus in the game. The power back. We're going to call a timeout. All right, Walter back in the game. We're going to try what worked earlier. A goal line pitch, and Wiley has got it. We're going to take the lead here with 20 seconds to go in the fourth quarter. Walter Wiley with the touchdown. They commit up the middle. We, of course, went to the outside. Or kicked the field goal, the extra point, to make this a touchdown game. 21-17 to Niners. Field goal does not tie the game. 20 seconds to go. Three timeouts for the Dallas Cowboys. This has got to be a win. Prescott going to throw. Lobbed up. Down on the ground. 
incomplete. With three timeouts, that's probably not a great start, just lobbing it up and hoping for the best, because that's what Dak Prescott just did right there. 14 seconds to go. Now they're probably in that range. He's going to lob it up, knock it down, or pick it off. It's going to hit the ground again. Incomplete pass number two will be third down. Third and 10. Prescott rolls out to his left. This will be the last play of the game. Prescott's going to run. We'll take that all day. That's game over. Cowboys not playing anything for, of you know, of course, they've already clinched the playoffs. But that is a big win for the San Francisco 49ers coming back late to win in the fourth quarter. Next week, when we come back, we will be in the wild card playoff playing the 10 and 6 Minnesota Vikings. We did not win the division. Seahawks likely going to be in a wild card matchup of their own, depending on what the records are. But that'll be next on the schedule, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Take it easy.